Hey guys, in the last video I showed you how to use the Roland MIDI adapter to be able to hook up and use Navicord. And in this video I wanted to show how to use a synth on your iPad instead to get that routed into your uh, MPC. And instead of using this uh, USB-C to USB-A cable, because you're going to want to have both audio and MIDI most likely output, and I've got the iPad Pro, which only has a USB-C port. I have uh, purchased a while ago this hyperdrive. Uh, the model number is HD319B. Um, I'll, I'll get a link for you, for you in the video or blog post or something. But as you can see here, it has a USB-C adapter. We don't really need HDMI on this, but it's there. Importantly, it's got an audio out and one USB connector. So to get this to work, just need to plug in your audio you plug in the usb over here and then on the mpc you want to connect in in this case i've got the uh roland m1 again just connect your in and outs there and then the audio from here should go into the inputs on your mpc so i'm just going to double tap the mute on my mpc live to or double tap mix on my mpc live to bring up the sampler menu, you just want to make sure you have sampling turn the monitoring set to in. And in this case, you can already see it's playing notes over. And when I come to main, the uh, main menu, all I need to do is just set myself up to MIDI. I've got the port A plugged in for the Roland. So I can now use pad performance and things to play notes on the MPC, I mean, for, uh, on the iPad from the MPC. So hopefully that gives you some ideas on how to get this set up for your own use. Anyway, take, you, take it easy and talk to you later, guys. Bye.